Hello Australia and welcome to the Upright Game Show. Well earlier on today we had the race that stopped the nation. Well now guys, we've got the show that stops the nation. Now unlike the race, people do not worry. You don't have to outlay hundreds of dollars to get good returns on this show. No sorry Bob. All you have to do is participate in the games and puzzles that we've got lined up for you guys to play over the next 90 minutes. That's correct. So guys, I hope you've had a good day today. Whether you've had a bet or not, you've tuned into the right show. Let's get in to our first game. It's Cup Date. Now um, what is the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held? And what was the last year this happened? It's a two-part question, guys. The first part, obviously, what is the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held? And what was the last year this happened? Well, today's the 1st of November. How many days in November? I don't know if that helps. And um, what was the last year this happened? So two-part question. We've got $150 up for grabs. The bonus board's at $1,750. You guys could be working home with $1,900. Now, tonight's show is themed especially for you guys because of the cup today. So we're playing cup games, Melbourne Cup games all day today. Now, you may have noticed the voice is a little bit hoarse. And, um, pardon the pun, the reason why the horse is coarse is, uh, well, my voice is coarse, is because of the horses, of course. And, and the Melbourne Cup and that... Fantastic mare, Maccabi Diva. Three in a row. Unbelievable. Now, um, first game. Let's settle in. 1902 555 222. That's the number you need, you need to be calling once you guys think you've got it figured out. 150 bucks up for grabs with this one. Bonus boards at $1750. $1900 could all be yours from one phone call. I like those odds, guys, and I hope you do too. Now, remember. It's a two-stage selection process. If you're chosen to register as a player, leave your name and contact number with area code so our cashed up call centre can call you back if you're selected to play. Now, we'll be randomly choosing players who have successfully left their details, and if that's you, we'll call you back and put you through to the studio to talk to me and play for cash. Now, guys, if your answer is wrong, we'll just keep taking callers until we have a winner. Every call costs 55 cents, higher for mobiles, and that's even if you don't get through to leave your details. But leave your details because if you don't get through to play a game you're still in with a chance to go into the draw for a hundred dollar Maya voucher now I'm sorry to WASANT and Queensland you can't play this game because of the time difference but don't worry because there is a game that everyone can play no matter what the time difference and that is the overnight game and it's also worth a massive 500 bucks and if you're the winner you also get the chance to play for a 42-inch plasma television thanks to Fujitsu General. So stay tuned, guys. All the details later in the show. But for now, let's get back to the game. Ooh, it's cup date. Let's have, a, let's have a read through the sentence and start seeing if we can't figure this one out at home. What is the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held? And what was the last year this happened? So it's a two-part question, guys. I'm after a date and a year. 1902. Triple five, triple two, that's the number you need to call once you think you have the answer or you just want to take a guess. We've got 150 bucks riding on this one. The first race, or the first game for tonight, and 1750 at the bonus board. Now guys, if you were watching last night, James was our very first winner of the brand spanking new bonus board. He took himself home $2,050. It can be done, it will be done. Let's hope that we can get another one done tonight. But before we can get to the bonus board, we need to get this game out of the way. It's cup date. What is the latest date in November? The Melbourne Cup can be held. And what was the last year this happened? Well, Melbourne Cup today, guys. We had the fashion, the parties, and of course, the race that stopped the nation. I mean, it's probably one of Australia's, if not Australia's, biggest annual sporting event. It'd have to be the biggest, and it was sensational. I couldn't get down to the track today, but I wanted to wear a bag and fruit just to feel a part of it, and um, you know, it looked good for you guys at home. Uh, if you did get to the track today, I hope you all had a great day out there and you had a good win. And if you're the ladies, you're dressed up in the dresses and the hats and the guys got in their bag of fruits as well and, and looked the part. Because even if you didn't win, if you looked the part, you're halfway there. But on this show, you don't even need to look the part. All you need to do is give us a call, 1902 
555522. 150 bucks up for grabs for the first one. 1750 at the bonus board. You could be walking home with $1,900. It's Cup Day. What is the latest date in November? The Melbourne Cup can be held. And what was the last year this happened? While you guys are dialing and leaving your details, it's time for the overnight game. Come with me. Have a look at this baby. All 42 inches of this plasma could all be yours. Now, last night, I asked the question. What question did I ask? That's right. The first Melbourne Cup was run when? Was it 1, 1861, 2, 2000, 3, 2001, or 4, 2010? Well, I thought it was 2010, but I can tell you Lisa from Barina in Victoria, she got the right answer, and she's won $500. Hello, Lisa. Hello, Lisa. Hello. Hello, how are you going? Good, thanks. Fantastic. Did you have a bet on the cup today? Yeah, I didn't do very well. You didn't do very well. I got the first one, oh, the well. Maccabi Diva. Well, it doesn't matter because, look, you've picked up $500 for I being know, the overnight fantastic. winner. So you're a big winner. No worries there, Lisa. And now I'm going to give you 15 seconds to see if you can't convince me why you deserve this 42-inch plasma television. Lisa, your time starts now. Okay. Um, don't know why. It just it would be great to have. Uh, my kids would love it. And my son's got everything crossed in the background. It'd just be good to have. It'd just be good to have. Well, thank you very much for that, Lisa. Now, I hope you're enjoying the show. Make sure you stay tuned because in a couple of weeks' time, I'll be announcing the winner of this plasma. It could be you. Okay. And, um, but you've done really well. You've won $500, oh, so you've fantastic. had a win today, Lisa. Thank fantastic. So Enjoy the rest of your night. Thank you. You See too. you later, Lisa. Thank you. Bye. Okay, well, let's get back to the game. The game is a cup date. Guys, what are we looking for? It's a two-part question. Um, well, look, if you don't know your horse racing, and we all know I know my horse racing, I'll tell you that the Cup is always held in the first week of November, or the first Tuesday, or something like that. Oops, have I given too much away? I hope so, because I want to line your pockets full of cash, guys. What is the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held, and what was the last year this happened? It's a two-part question. Not as tricky as it sounds, guys. Do a little bit of research, get on the internet, do whatever you need to do, but just make sure you can give me a call and get the answer right. Well, two parts. First one, latest date in November. So date, date and year, guys. Date and year, simple. Simple, very, very easy. Mm. Now, I wonder if it got moved to the latest date because of the Olympics. I don't know. Do you know at home? It's worth 150 bucks. If you don't know, it's worth finding out. It's probably even worth having a guess, but in order to have a go, guys, you need to give us a call. 1902 Now, um, 150 bucks up for grabs. Bonus boards at 1750 $1,900 could all be yours from one phone call. Cup date. What is the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held, and what was the last year this happened? Keep thinking about it, guys. As soon as you think you have the answer, give us a call. I'll be taking callers straight after this break. So you've got plenty of time to do your research and get on the dog and bone and give us a call. I want to hear all about it. If you're at the Cup today, sensational. If you weren't, it doesn't matter. We've still got the show. We've got heaps of cash lined up for you tonight. But we've got to get rid of this first one. It's Cup Day. Do you guys know your Cup trivia? I know my Cup trivia. Trivia. I can tell you that Mackay Diva was the first mayor, and probably, well, the only mayor, to win the Cup three times in a row. Sensational. But we don't need to worry about Maccabi right now. What we need to do is figure out what the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held is and what was the last year this happened. Two-part question, guys. Once you think you have the answer, give us a call. 1902 555 222. 150 bucks up for grabs. I'm taking callers right after this break. Welcome back to the Up Late Game Show. Thank you very much for tuning in, guys. Tuesday, the Melbourne Cup's gone, but we're here on the Up Late Game Show. That's why I'm wearing the bag of fruit. Any excuse to dress up for you guys at home. And uh, the first game of the night, it's Cup Date. Tonight, the whole game's going to be tailored around a Melbourne Cup theme. First game is Cup Date. It's a two-part question, guys. What is the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held? And what was the last year this happened? Were you doing your research during the break? I hope you were. You should be. Ha you should have it figured out by now, guys. I'm trying to help. 1902 That's the number you need to call if you'd like to get amongst the cash. We've got $150 riding on this first game. $1750 at the bonus board. 
$1,900 could all be yours from one phone call. Cup Day. What is the latest date in November? The Melbourne Cup can be held. And what was the last year this happened? Do you know at home? Well, if you know, give us a call. 1902 555 222. While you're dialing and leaving your details, why don't we go and have a look at a game that can be played by everybody right around Australia? It is, of course, the overnight game. Now, what the new overnight question for $500 is How many times in a row has Maccabi Diva won the Melbourne Cup? Um, I think I've given that answer away about five or six times tonight already. Is it one, two times, two, three times, three, four times, or four, none in a row? It's another toughie, guys. It's another toughie, but it's worth $500. 1902 zero. that's the number you need to be calling. And all you have to do, guys, is leave your name, number, and your area code so we can call you back if you're the winner. When you call us, all you have to do is simply press the number on your telephone keypad that corresponds with the answer. So one, two, three or four, it's as simple as that. Calls cost 55 cents, they're higher for mo mo mobiles, and, and as I said, just make sure you leave your name, number, and area code so we can call you back if you're the winner. Now, if you are the winner, not only will, you hook, not only will we hook you up with $500, we'll also give you the opportunity to play for this magic 42-inch plasma television thanks to our friends at Fujitsu General. So that question again, how many times in a row has Maccabi Diva won the Melbourne Cup? Is it one, two times? Two, three times, four, three, four times, or four, none in a row. 1902, triple five, double two, zero. 500 bucks and a plasma. But let's get back to the game. Cup date. Cup date. What is the latest date in November the Melbourne Cup can be held? And what was the last year this happened? 1902, triple five, triple two. I think it's time we took some calls. We've got Linda on the line. How are you going tonight, Linda? Good, thanks. That's great. Where are you calling from? Uh, sale. In Sale. Now, well, Lindy, do you think you have the answers? I hope so. I hope so, too. It's for 150. What are we looking for? Uh, the 7th of November. Yes. And 2003. 7th of November, 2003. I don't think that's right, unfortunately. No worries. Thanks for trying, though. Thanks, anyway. Come on, guys, Bye. keep going. We're getting there. We're getting there. We've got Nicole on the line. Let's see if Nicole can't put some money in her pocket. How are you going tonight, Nicole? Good. That's great. Now, do you think you've got the right answer? I hope so. I hope so too. Let's have it. Uh, the 6th of November and 2001. No, I'm sorry. That's incorrect, but keep trying. Thank you. No worries. My pleasure. Have a good night. You too. Okay, so what have we had so far? We've had the 7th of November in 2003, and then we've had the 6th of November in 2001. Hmm. Let's see if James has got it right. Hello, James. How are you going tonight? Good, mate. How are you? Very, very well. Did you back a winner today? Yes, I had McCarvey. Ah, uh, sensational, mate. So did I. Now, let's see if you can't get another winner. 150 uh, bucks up for grabs here, mate. What, what do you think the answer is? Well, the last date would be the 7th of November. Um, and what last year? Last time it happened in November. And the last year it happened will be 2000. 7th of November and 2000. Is that right? Yes, it's right. Well done, James. 150 bucks, mate. Congratulations. Beautiful. You're having a sensational day, mate. Win yeah, the, win the cup. Now you've won this. Let's see if you can't win the bonus board. All right. How do I play that, mate? I'm going to tell you, James. No worries. Now, Beautiful. listen, this is the way it works, James. From these numbers, I'm going to give you three choices, okay? From the numbers 1 to 12, I'm giving you three choices. All you have to do, if you can reveal three of my Tom and Fred's, three of my heads, you'll win the bonus board. It's at 17.50. However, if you only reveal one of my faces, it represents $0, and two of my faces represent $0, okay? So when you're ready, mate, no yep. matter what, you're guaranteed to pick up some more cash, James. So when you're ready, what's your first choice? What number would you like to go with first? Um, go number one. Go number one. Yep. That's $1. $1. Second choice. You can keep uh, adding, keep adding. Number seven. Number seven. That's one of my face, so you've still got a dollar. Now you've got one more choice. You don't want another one of my faces. You want another number. Hopefully we can get your five or something like that. Okay. Um, What's we'll the go nine. Number? Nine's the lucky number. Yes, it is. Congratulations, mate. You just picked up another four hundred and one dollars. Beautiful. $551, James. Thanks for playing, mate, and uh, I hope the cash comes in handy for you. No worries. Thanks, Cheers, mate. mate. You have a good night. You too. See you later, buddy. Yeah.
See how easy it is winning cash on this show? My God. James back the diva. Now he's, now he's coming one a... 500 and something dollars, sensational. Let's get into our next game. It's how many cup winners? Now, well, uh, all you have to do, guys, is have a look inside this grid and see how many cup winners. So inside the grid, there's a whole heap of horses that have won the cup. All you have to do is find all those horses and tell me how many cup winners. You've got to look every way, guys. Forwards, backwards, you know the drill. Any which way you can. Pick out the cup winners and give us a call. 1902 555 222. We've got 200 bucks up for grabs.